What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Thank you for tuning in. Spent all morning cleaning the truck here and it looks really, really good. However, we're about to make this truck look even better with a little bit more paint match. Truck is coming along very well. OEM plus look, I think it looks really good. The last video we put out, we actually put some paint to match Ram letters up on the front grill. I think that looks awesome from our guys over at Retro Shop, of course. Now we do have some more paint match stuff for this truck. So in the process of making this truck freaking awesome in my opinion. The biggest thing that we wanted to do was turn all the lights on the truck white. From factory, cab lights are amber, mirror lights are amber. You got a bunch of junk up here, so. In the process of doing that, I mean, obviously like we headlights, fog lights, all that fun stuff are white, bright light and LED. Boost Auto Parts sent us some switchback mirror lights, which are freaking awesome. And then at that point, it leaves us with nothing but the cab lights being amber. So what myself and literally everybody else does in the aftermarket game, because it's the cheapest option, or we go with recon cab lights. Recon cab lights are like 200 bucks or dirt cheap. And you could choose like a smoked or a clear lens we did smoked of course because this whole theme here is red and black and we did a white LED light which looks pretty good I'll show you a photo right here the biggest issue is they freaking leak every single person I know that has recon cab lights they leak and you could tell how bad they leak even after I literally like cemented these things to the roof if you see how bad of a job this looks like I literally because these just keep leaking and I don't know where they're leaking from so it turns out even after I like legit cemented every single one of these stupid lights they still leak and they leak with this lens and they leak every time it rains the entire way down my a pillar here comes right out my handle leaks all over my floor and stuff like that and that of course is an issue so we are freaking replacing these recon lights with a much more expensive solution however a much better solution real quick guys check out the new KTM just picked this up literally like two days ago it's a 2023 used believe it or not KTM 500 EXCF dual sport I freaking love dual sports if you've been around the channel for a couple years I had a DRZ 400 this thing is loads way more fun than that if you want KTM content uh, let me know in the comments I'll be happy to get you content Corvette's actually next on the chopping block to get clean because we had some bird do some dirty business on the hood so not cool uh, still have some parts for the Audi here going on all this entire corner is Audi parts and then what we're replacing are recon cab lights with Or these. These, my dear, I'll show you. Bam. These. These are my OEM cab lights sent into Retro Shop for a white LED and freaking paint match. Look, let me see if I can set that down to focus my camera. Look how beautiful that's going to be on the truck. Look how beautiful it's gonna be on a truck. Super excited about this. I actually have got these, I've had these for like two months. Just haven't had the time actually to put them on because it keeps raining. But OEM cab lights, so we know they don't leak. They're sealed, redone, all by Retro Shop. And, but the difference is now they're freaking paint matched. They're paint matched, I'm super excited for that. So actually what I'm going to do, I'm going to rip like one, two, I'll probably rip like at least two of those off real quick. I will turn these on and show you the difference because like these have a much direct more white LED light than the recons. We'll show you how clean these look compared to these and how much nicer and whiter and brighter the LED is on the OEM ones versus these. So one sec. My Lord, look at those. Those are gonna look fantastic on this truck. All right, so check this out. Pried out all the goop that I have, like, you know, I did this one here, pried out the goop. Look how, like, even, like, rusty and stuff that screw is. And I probably sealed these holes in, like, after a couple thousand miles. Like, and this is the OEM screw that is, like, a T20 in beautiful shape, even though it was, like, on the truck for, like, a year. These are, like, literally two and a half millimeter hex keys that have been on the truck for, like, two months before I silicone the whole thing crazy the hard part is going to be getting these off the damn truck since i like siliconed them literally all over I'm, i hope i didn't hurt the paint too bad keeps on going 
Interesting. At least it's nice and sunny and it's like heating this stuff up pretty well. <laughs> look at the sight and look at the freaking water. I told you. My lord, before it dries, look at the water. That's how well you can see it on the inside of my freaking cab. Not sure how well you can see it on camera. But there's a bunch of moisture down there. All right, guys. So got one replaced. Don't mind the literal mess I made with all the all the freaking cement that I had on this thing. Just look at that. And if I turn the lights on, so same thing. This is what I was saying. So look how clean that LED is versus just a freaking big like this is this, that's sick it looks like a freaking shark bite or something like that there's a nice clear lens for it to go through not shining through the paint and this was just literally like a bulb of light so super excited about this i'm going to obviously do as many of these as i can real quick and then i'll get you good befores and afters at nighttime a few moments later oh my god you can actually see these in the freaking bright sunlight. Look at that. So these three done, of course, and you could probably tell. And these are the recon still. And same thing like I was just saying. Look how nice and bright that LED is versus literally you can't really see anything. If I shut the lights off, back off. Oh mama, look at that. Look how good those three look versus just like a black blob. Color match all the freaking way, man. guys what do you think personally of course i'm biased i think they look great they are super super bright you were not able to see this kind of light out of the recons this looks freaking incredible of course they're oem so oem are always going to look nicer than of course aftermarket and then just jeremy from retro shop the way he paints stuff man this he makes stuff look so good his color match is freaking on point it looks great just like just like our ram badges do here just like these heavy duty badges do here just like literally everything else that he did like the third brake light right up there our tail lights right there our tailgate badge there i mean this dude is the bomb so huge shout out to retro shop now of course like i said these aren't sponsored i paid for this stuff of course however i wish i would have went this route from the get-go instead of spending and wasting the money on the recons having them leak and then having to literally like almost silicone every single crevice I could possibly think about to the truck because that was just a pain taking off to put these ones back on. So hopefully these don't leak. They shouldn't, they didn't leak before I got them painted and everything like that before I moved them to begin with. I think we're gonna be okay. So that's, I think for now, the last paint match piece that I'm gonna be putting on the truck. I don't know guys, what do you think? Do you like the way it looks? I think it looks awesome personally, all white. And uh, I think the OEM cab lights are the way to go, very tasteful. So um, that's literally it guys. Uh, like the video if you haven't already, subscribe, join the family, join the Cummins content behind me. I'll see you guys next week, peace.